Hello, I'm Larry and this is Carter's Country. With a record number of gun buyers that we've seen in the past two years, first time gun buyers, I should say, uh, we're gonna do a video about just the very basics. And the first one we're gonna do is about loading a magazine. You know, magazines, especially your higher capacity magazines, you get down towards the end and uh, it can be pretty punishing on the tip of your thumb. We're gonna talk about a couple of devices that'll help you get past that. But first, we're just gonna start with some loading basics uh, without a device. Now, uh, for most of you, especially if you're in my age group, uh, you learned one way to load a magazine and that's by hand. Uh, let me just show you a little bit, uh, again, just some basics about how to do that. If you can see here on the magazine, you've got a little lip here and a little lip here. What you do with a good grip on the magazine, push the round down, you just get it just under the lip uh, there and then just push back. And it's pretty simple, especially at the start. Uh, you just go next one down under the lip, push it back. Now, when you're loading these magazines, you'll, your ammunition should be kind of angled up as you're loading. That's the, the proper way for it to go in. This is a Glock magazine. You can see here on the back, it has uh, little holes and numbers here so you can look and tell how many rounds you've loaded in case you forget. A lot of magazines will have holes on the side, but that's a good way in case you get called away, phone rings, something happens, you come back, you're not sure how many's in it. Most magazines will have a, a quick, easy way for you to tell. Uh, if you're new to all this, little rule of thumb, something to make it easy for beginners. If you set the magazine down flat on the table, you want it leaning forward, your ammunition, the back of the round, will be at the back of the uh, magazine. If you think about it, the, the handle of most any semi-automatic firearm has a forward lean to it, so it only makes sense that you're looking for the magazine to be the same way. You take your first round, you push it in, you get just under those little lips right there. You see it's now, it's held in place. You just push the round all the way back in, and then you just keep doing that until the magazine's full. Uh, it's pretty easy. Under the lip, slide it back and you just keep on for the 10, 15 rounds, whatever uh, capacity your magazine is. Next, we're gonna talk about a couple of things that, that you can use to help make this a little easier. If you've ever loaded a magazine, you know when you get down to those last two or three rounds, that spring in that, in that magazine is really, really tight and it can get pretty punishing on your end of your thumb, uh, trying to push down hard enough to get that round under the lips of the magazine. Okay, this is a Glock magazine here. Uh, a lot of times uh, your pistol will come with a speed loader or load assist in the, in the, in the box with the gun. Uh, this one came with the Glock 19 uh, Gen 5. This is a really simple one to use. What you do is it slides over the magazine like that. I'm gonna turn it to where you can kind of see what's going on there. Okay, and the way you'll use this, you slide this over. You've got a little, uh, little notch hanging down there that will uh, compress the magazine glide down for you. You put your round in far enough to be under the, uh, the lips of the magazine and then you push it back. And then you just keep repeating that with each round, push it down, get this just far enough in, take the pressure off, push the round back. I'm gonna try to turn it and do it this way so you can maybe see it better in the camera. This goes down, the round goes in, lift it up and just push the round back. With a little bit of practice, this is really fast to do. It is so much easier on your thumb. If you Trust me, if you're gonna go to the range and you're gonna be shooting a lot and you're gonna be reloading magazines all day, you will absolutely wanna use some sort of load assist, uh, whether your gun comes with one or you go buy one uh, to get that done. This is uh, made by a company called Uplula. This one will fit a variety of different pistols. Uh, it works a little bit different in that it goes to the front with the, uh, with the little tongue there that suppresses the round down. But it, it's the same general principle, it's trying to save your hand. If you've shopped with us at Carter's Country before, then you've probably seen one of these here. Uh, this Up Lula is kind of the Cadillac of the uh, load assist or speed loader. It's really, really easy, not only on your hands, but again, it's, it's saving your thumb from some sheer misery uh, if you're trying to load a full magazine. The way this one works, you squeeze forward, all the way forward, you press down, you get the round in there, then you release this, it clears the round, and then you're ready for the next one. So there's really nothing else to do other than guide the, uh, the round in. The Up Lula does everything else for you. Now this one, uh, because it does have a little bit of moving parts where, where the other one didn't, it does take a little bit more practice, but I assure you, once you get familiar with this, once you get comfortable with this, you will not believe how fast you can get a magazine loaded, uh, not only fast, but pain-free. 
again, you just let it release it so it clears. And then you just grab the next round and you can keep going. And even in a high capacity magazine like this Glock, uh, you can, can load all 15 rounds fast, no stress on your hands, uh, which, you know, if you're out there shooting all day, you want your hands uh, basically focusing on, on, on your grip and your technique and not having to favor a, a thumb tip that's bloody or, or bruised because you've been trying to force that 14th and 15th round in there all day. Okay, well, I hope this has helped some of you. Uh, if you've never tried to use a load assist before, or if you're a new new uh, gun owner and just haven't gotten the hang of loading a, a magazine yet. And also, if uh, you know someone who just got their first gun, be sure and share this video with them. Uh, another thing, if they just got their first gun, share this video with them, and this will make a great stocking stuffer. And they are available at all our Carter Country locations. Uh, hope this helped. We're gonna continue to walk through videos uh, with our first time gun owners in mind. Try to take you through this, help you feel more comfortable. Uh, and more satisfied with your purchase and feel better and more responsible as a gun owner. Remember, if you've ever shot, shot or hunted with us, then you're already a part of the Carter's Country family. Till next time, adios. I don't know, I feel like I'm stumbling through it because I've never really used one of these things. Uplula does everything else for you. Cut. So the way this one works, you squeeze forward, press, okay. These are usually straight at the camera. Everything's good. This is a limited production gun, again, that has very limited distribution. Now that head wiggle really gets the uh, earplug in, I guess. You know, one of the most amazing things about working in Carter's country is that I get paid to do things like what I'm about to do. Kiki on the bottom of Justin's barrel is actually a camera recording his shots. That's the... It was hard to get through that without laughing. There's nothing like the smell of gunpowder and the feel of recoil to get my blood pumping. <laughs> it's like, how much practice does that take? I was gonna get to that part, y'all cut me off right at the knees though. <clears throat> Jeez. Let the man create. <laughs> He's acting his ass off here. <laughs> <laughs> I stand corrected now. Let me go with the many more, the many more purposes of this firearm right now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, I, I really wish y'all could see some of the outtakes, but trust me, you really can't.